sorry, the mayor's busy. Do you have an appointment? Uh, the mayor's doing debate prep. He really can't be disturbed right now. Excuse me, Mr. Wayne? Uh, I was really hoping you'd be able to help me out. Who knows, maybe I could return the favor one day. It seems you do have an appointment, Mr. Wayne. Silly me. Bruce Wayne? Finally, you've come to see me. Of course, only after your name's been dragged through the mud. Don't get me wrong, I'm glad to see you. But you're a day late and a great many dollars short. This isn't a social call, Hill. I'm here for answers. Well, well, straight to business. And I was going to have Deborah make you a martini. Your father and I, we took this city and made it ours. Falcone too, rest his soul. We built everything we have. You were born with it. A young man like you wouldn't understand what it takes to rise to the top. Oh, I understand. Very well. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Sounds like me. It is you. So? What's your point? I take it you have one. Or are you just fond of my dulcet tones? You're working with Oswald Cobblepot and his thugs. Working with them? They're a bigger threat to order than those masked freaks. I'm in Cobblepot's crosshairs, same as you. But you fed them dirt on me. Only the files I seized from Wayne Manor. Your father, Falcone, and I, we had ways of getting anything we wanted. How do you think your family got the land for Wayne Tower? Cobblepot wants retribution because we took his family's land. Oswald's family signed it over to us, along with the rest of their assets. Even if that's true, it's no excuse for Cobblepot's crimes. I quite agree. It doesn't hurt to understand your enemy's motives. There's so much more I could share, if only we were friends. I could help you deal with Penguin, let you in on some family history. But I'm caught in a dogfight for my political career, and my rival has bottomless pockets. Now, if that rival were to say, drop out, or his advertising spend were to dry up, I might have a lot more resources for helping a new friend. Fine. That's what it takes to earn your friendship. I knew you'd see the light. It's time we really talked. Power is an old oak. The trunk stands strong, but it's the roots that hold it up. And the thickest of them lead to Arkham. Arkham Asylum? Your father, me, Falcone. We used it to get our enemies out of the way. Drugged and declared them insane. It made it easy to take their things. Thomas was the doctor. I leveraged my political power to ease the transfer of assets. Falcone was the muscle. He had his own way of making problems go away. My father... I... I can't believe he'd be part of that. It doesn't matter if you believe. Penguin does, and he's not happy about it. Gotham was chaos before we took control. At least now there's a semblance of order. Listen, Bruce. Now that we're back on the same side, your father's last gift to me. They're yours. The keys to the city. Thank you. Hamilton. Call me Hamilton. Penguin's gathered quite a few victims to his crusade. But that's a problem for another day. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to prep for the debate. My door is always open, Bruce. Next time, make an appointment. Whatever deal you made with Penguin, he won't honor it. Don't worry about me. He's not the first to take a shot at me. Alfred. Get a warning to Gordon. Tell him to increase security the debate. Hill seems to think he's safe, but Penguin's still out there. 